and he'll light heavyweight showdown for the ages. What are your thoughts about fighting Sergey Kovalev? You know me, Max. I want to fight the best. I've always fought the best. It's not a matter of if, I just think it's when. Kovalev lived up to his side of the deal by dispatching Isaac Chalemba. Clearing the rush of the 175-pound mega bout is Colombian opponent Alexander Brand. If I don't take care of my business tonight against Alexander Brand, I understand it, um, but it, it's, it's not something I think about on a day-to-day -day basis. It's not easy. If it was easy, everybody would do it. Uh, but we Brand, unlike many of the South American fighters we've seen over the years, has an extensive amateur background and, in fact, maintains close ties. Is that all these years of suits to this moment of time, the world may be overlooking me, but that'll be the surprise for them. They will see who Alexander Brand is on Saturday, and we will give the best fight possible. And his professional Olympic gold medal champ. Couple of miles. Lev's record uh, off jersey. Most see that. Ward takes a body shot from Brand, and then Brand falls off balance. Yeah, about that fight, if you favor Kovalev. I think Ward here is tall and linky. We've seen a great deal of that, more and more of it, in I recent hands in front. So far early in this with by the other opponent. And so I think he's the best in boxing at creating what the opponent can do. You'll notice on and or left hook off the, off the jab, like he just Andre is setting up traps for him. He's in a pocket, he came out with his hands, Max. He's looking for an opportunity to throw punches in between. Bates, his opponent, 20, but then finally turned professional at goals um, that come from anticipated angles. Well, Alexander can make you look bad because a wide angle, like he just did all over. He can catch you with either punch. Yeah. Did not have up against Chalemba a few weeks ago. He punched that he from him, some of us not want to show yeah and, and you know, it's, it's really hard for, for motivation loving grandmother towards four children ward continues to think that there was a, a sense in boxing that maybe kovalev was and maybe he'd have been distracted fighting off kovalev and since they might think that uh, small moments where brand has some success i, I think maybe andre uh, near his hometown in Russia for the first time. Ward does, but Kovalev may have been distracted by the occasion in Russia. Ward, a couple of left hooks for Brand. Short punches inside and try to catch him coming in to make it look like... 30 to 27, Andre Ward. I, I mean, he's doing what normally does, but, you know, look, in truth, is it may, three to nothing. Before the fourth round, the hell Letterman said, Brand, yep. Night, right? Because the point, I think, properly in a... Well, there's nothing on these punches Alexander just throwing. It's just a matter of time that Andre, you know, closed the show and just ribs. Yeah, another the Ward appeared bothered, excuse me, Brand is bothered by a punch because his movements are so awkward and stiff. So a sign that he don't like them. Employing them because it's been done before. And he just showed me that he's a real, real champion, real man that wants to make him risk. And he's done what old school have done. He's done with Roy Jones, myself, and others. And I, I commend him for doing it the best professional opponent Triple G will have faced. I think that's a, a really nice fight. Um, and considering how hard it is, the opponent, undefeated and quite good, that's showing up to try to win the fight and is anyway not really a big welterweight. Here, we told you Alexander Brand was awkward. And, and I think that's one of the reasons the four or five rounds is in there. Big, big pressure on him. Yeah, I think Andre's going right back to the body with the right hand. Well, he Max, you want to go... Jim and doing it on a high note. Good, good body shot by Brand. Most dominant power out Chad Dawson, who was and came down and wait to fight Ward. Good shots because Andre just, you know, there are Ward is really a complete fighter. Left hand because he see but Ward is a natural left hander. So this is the stance in which he and was on a ropes. This is a perfect time where the right hand goes to the ribs and then a the left hand up top. Following up with the left hand was the key. The second round, paper between Ward and Kovalev. Now Ward still in the southpaw stand. Dre end the night early. Um, how ready is he for the ultimate if he gets his guy out of there? Which made its point, although didn't really hurt Brand that badly. It was the balance of both fighters. You know, trying to please anyone but himself. He tries to get the win. And is not the kind of fighter that's going to try to force a stoppage if he doesn't see it come naturally. But to get the attention of the critics and the attention in pound for pound number one. I think he's kind of doing that this round. In the last two rounds, keeps a statistic called all the top fighters in the sport, according to versus the number of punches, they're a virgin. Coming into tonight, the opponents have landed against him. 
He sees the top spot at Brampton. And lands a lot more punches between here and the end. Also because he moved up the light head having eight rounds. Andre switches to softball, throwing a left. Not a huge puncher. He's not a bad puncher. He's a sharp one. But it's when Kovalev hits a good one. Hey, you got him. You know when fights taking good punches, but it certainly keeps you in the 60 to 54. Andre Ward. You have to be there truly venerable, knows, as Harold knows. Letterman is, to call a 39-year-old. Well, Alexander right now, jab. Tip jab. Ward seems to be trying. He can finish Brand sometime with his perfect. Uh, puncher, but not as any sharp puncher for a boxer, but clearly have taken some big shots together That's when I think we're gonna see an exit From out many rounds ago start putting these punches together Then he has a better shot of wearing Alexander downward and is moving away and is trying as hard to avoid no, punches Andre, as he now. is to land them Well, he has a good he has to be kind of a little wary Larry head, but one of the things he and I agreed upon if there are no accidents, I think you nailed it one hand. He's awkward and on the other hand, opportunities for Andre, and yet he's throwing enough awkward haymakers. Takes the risk to get a fair puncher that can, you know, a lot more combinations than right hand over the top. Guy who had a very long and illustrious career in boxing, what it once was, a fighter who's very difficult to beat. And I think right now, round eight, it's time for our time to be that golden November the November fight is pay-per-view, something that stimulates them. It, it, it's, a, it's sport. And Yes, he is. See, he senses that he can get the knockout, and now it appears that he's actually... Andre Ward likes to say that there's a particular triple crown of box finances and create a legacy. have achieved the most. He does point to Floyd Mayweather. And... Andre wants him. If this guy could get aggressive, he's to put some punches. Power punch, or at least make an awkward style to try to open... Downside of going the distance that Sergey Andre Ward... Yeah, I, I think it's a benefit to Sergey because you see the less as possible tonight. He was trying to knock Brand out right there. And I want to send that message, Jim. I want to send that message to the ones that don't, that I'm ready for this. Andre is a complete fighter. Home run shots, even when they're landing, they're, they're hurting Brand. But you up, and he'll take your heart because he's have a chance. And then he has tremendous. He believed that Sergey going to be might be. Oh, it's on a high level we need to work on. This would be a good moment for Ward to touch his Definitely looking to knock him out. I think that Alex of a punch, you know? He, he looks like he's going to distance because no matter what Ward hits it, the guy just shakes it off. It's incredible. Alexander Brand is still in there, you know? I, I mean, he's hardly been staggered. He's really fighting a good fight. Nine to nothing, Andre Ward. Different opponents, so maybe impossible. Any blueprint on how he comes in, he got rounds in. You know, he got repetition. And, and, he, got and repetition. he went through another training camp. And he went through the process of... of... The audience only... He needs that, all that to, to... Does have a proven chin against unknown opposition. His career. Ward has not scored any one shot at a time. It's going to take a combat. Any Russian fighter, right. Bernard. Yeah. You got knocked down by Sergey Kovalev. Oh, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> That's different. And I don't think there's anything Ward would win, probably still think so, and vice versa. But ask here. Does, does Wait, hold. Just to get it there so the right hand can land on the spot. And Brand is still standing. Is He has a pretty tricky weapon because, like you said, his off on off It's a skill. That's something that you're taught. And he's using effectively. As a matter of fact, that's statistic, which is going to prompt. Either the observation that Brand was that Ward stepped up his nine fights, Ward's opponents average landing nine punches per round. Alexander Brand is landing unhittable for Alexander. Oh yeah, Ward has one too. He's a great offensive fighter. And that's why the offensive fighter has to be out of character. I have that onslaught. Minus the thump. Yeah, but it was one shot. You know, he has to boxing medium. Great well great well rounded team. Never look as good Swipe against all, mediocrity as great all the things he could do as much as Andre When it comes to rounds Where I'd be 
came in with a wild left hook with his head also accidentally looks like but they clash heads and that's the danger for fight exactly the question is do you get a delay it's a show and I, because of things that can happen some nights i would say i think he wanted to close the show yeah combinations like that show you that oh frazier to outbox his opponent and if you're asking a sharp but not devastating puncher i'm in a fight or, or and you know i'm going to step out of i'm going to get nasty i want to as a fighter especially and um i don't think is capable of fighting out of control bernard i'll be honest i saw several fights walked away with the decision win because it was easy and because you like andre Wood, and risk taking involves a guy that I know that could be enough because Andre did had him through many situations. Meantime, he defeated the fighting block. Sergey Kovalev, light heavyweight champ, are all.